vessel of honor. It is absolutely not out of place to say that good leadership is one of the pains of Africa's growth, both economically and otherwise. And why bad leadership is so common among Africans, it is another ill that calls for worries. Therefore, seeing an African leader exhibit a virtue that can be termed alien to them suits the soul, and a testament that it is neither due to their geographical location, nor the color of their skin, but the choice of the individuals in question. A visit to Borno State a state that has been under attacks for over a decade, speaks of a people who, despite all that has befallen them, are firmly confident of a better tomorrow. This can only be when the people are sure of their future. And their future, to a very large extent, is dependent on the person at the helm of affairs. Governor Kashim Shatima, has distinguished himself among his contemporaries, not just in words, but in deeds. I say this boldly because I'm a proponent of leave what you say. He has demonstrated beyond any reasonable doubt that he is a leader whose heart is after the welfare of his people. I find very touching when he admitted that he gives preference to his duties as a governor over his responsibilities as a father and hopes that his children would one day, when he is no longer in office, look back to all he's been able to achieve and forgive him. Such words can only come from a man who has truly presented himself as a vessel unto honor. As he tells day and night to see the burden of his dreams come alive, I pray that God in his infinite mercy meets him at the point of his needs. God bless Borno.